So Jacob, uh, we're now a couple of days away from the semi-final as the FFA Cup. Uh, we'll go all the way back to the quarter-final, uh, the 6-0 victory. Um, how was it for you playing in what was one of the most impressive Mariners performances in a long time? Yeah, it was um, amazing to be a part of. Six goals is always hard to do against any team. So it was good from the boys to get the get the win and such a good win as well down in Leichhardt with with a lot of crowd which, which weren't really behind us, behind Leichhardt. So yeah, it was really, really good game. And obviously again, we're going to be playing Sydney FC away from home. Uh, we love, we always seem to be playing away matches and you know, you've been involved in quite a few away matches and things. Do you use that as like kind of a, a fuel to try and use as motivation that, you know, you, the fans are in the minority as well, but you're here to kind of be the underdogs and upset them? Yeah, definitely. It's always good to get a win away from home, especially especially in a big game like a semi. It was like round one in Newcastle, it was great to get the win down up there and it just creates a bit more of a, a fire to get the win when, when you're playing away. And uh, with COVID and the way it's impacted the team, it's obviously not been ideal in terms of preparations, but have you found it kind of adjusting to different protocols and training changing and always being on your feet? Has it been hard to kind of follow up with and stay on your toes? Yeah, it's been pretty hard, you know, just being careful what you're doing every day, not going out, mingling with different people and, you know, but it's um, something that we have to do to keep everyone safe and I think the boys are doing really well with it. And you haven't played in a month or so, you must be itching at the chance to do that and this will come on Tuesday against their Sydney FC in the Cup. Are you really looking forward to that match? Yeah, I think all the boys are really looking forward, we're just excited to get out. So yeah, I think it will be a great game and the boys are really keen to get a win and get to the final. And we did play Sydney FC in the league a couple of weeks ago and obviously a game is different all the time, but uh, do you reckon the fact that you've already played them this season and you know, is that going to play into your advantage? Yeah, I think it does help a little bit, but you, you can't really rely on previous results. You know, Sydney FC are a great team and I think we'll just have to see on the day and hopefully get the win. And at the, all these games and things that you're playing at, do you have a lot of family who go along and see you or do you get a lot of messages and things from people, mates and the like? Uh, support you? Yeah, I've got a lot of um, family and close friends who support me, so I'm grateful for that. And it's just, it's a good bunch of boys with a close knit, you know, environment. So it's it's really good. And you know, coming into the squad, uh, you are one of the youngest in the squad. Have you found that you've had a good mentorship from a lot of the senior boys, like Ollie and Simo, Marco as well, and even like RT and uh, Rosie at the back? Yeah, all those boys have been really helpful. You know, in pre-season and the start of the season, it's good having um players like that who can, who has um, all their belief in you and it gives you a lot more confidence in the game, so yeah, it's good.